Welcome to eSecure 2.0. Today, we will be going over how to navigate the main eSecure interface and giving you a brief preview of each of the sections. After you have received your username and password via email, please validate your account using the link provided. Please note that when signing in in the future, you will need to use the following steps to reach the eSecure page. Go ahead and type in www.protectionthenumeral1.com in the address bar of your browser. From here, we'll select eSecure Web and Mobile from the drop down menu on the top right hand side of the page. Select eSecure 2.0 from this screen and it will take us to the login screen. Here, you will enter your username and password and click Connect. If you happen to have forgotten your username and password, click this link and it will take you through the steps in retrieving that information. Okay, now that we're in eSecure, you'll notice a display for your local weather at the top of the screen. Click on this to reveal a five-day forecast for your area. Check the messages you have received by clicking on the envelope icon, which will appear here. You can click and drag the menu bars to arrange them in the order that you prefer. Click on the plus icon in each menu to expand it. Click the minus icon to collapse the menu back to its original size. In the security tab, you can arm and disarm your alarm, as well as access any of the standard features of your system using the virtual keypad. The Automation tab allows you to control your thermostat, door locks, switches, and dimmers of your P1 Life system. The Users tab lets you edit and delete the profiles that have been created for your system. This video section allows you to control how your cameras behave and access your live video feeds as well. Locations is where you will see all the separate places that you have a security panel. Finally, the events, rules, and notifications section allows you to customize when and how you receive alerts from your Protection One security system. If you would like further information on any of these sections, please feel free to see one of our other instructional videos, which will go into more detail about them.